Doji is adding amazing features to its rugged devices. The Doji V20 was the first rugged device to have a red display and after that Doji released Doji S98. It also has a red display. Now Doji has done something new again. The true successor of the Doji V10 has been revealed. It is the Doji V11. The Doji V11 is very similar to the Doji V10 in terms of specs but it has something that all rugged devices lacks okay it has the fastest charging technology compared to all rugged devices the highest i've seen on previous rugged devices is 33 watts but the doji v11 supports 65 watts fast charging now that's insane because especially because of its battery it has the same battery as the doji v10 and just so you know the specs of the doji v11 is very similar to the specs of the doji v10 except for the fast charging capability and uh, many of the specs of the doji v11 are still not known yet because the device hasn't been officially announced by doji yet if you know of any other device that has up to 65 watts fast charging make sure to share in the comment section below so the doji v11 like i mentioned before is very similar to the doji v10 in terms of specs the few specs that has been reviewed are its display it has the same display as the doji v10 a 6.39 inch perhaps AZ plus display as well currently the resolution of the display has not been reviewed but it has the same size uh, with that of the doji v10 we all know that the doji v10 has an AZ plus resolution so we do not know if this new rugged phone has an AZ plus or a full AZ plus resolution or anything higher than that. It has the same SOC as the Doji V10, the Dimensity 700. It also has the same memory and the same battery. I think one of the, uh, perhaps the only difference that I spotted between the Doji V11 and the V10 is the fast charging support, which is, like I said, 65 watts, the highest on any rugged device the highest i've seen guys the highest the best and it's actually quite good because the doji v11 has a really big battery an 8500 milliamp power battery 33 watts would definitely do a good job but 65 watts will do even better we all know that anyway this is just an update i'll be sharing more updates with you guys in the future so make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications share your thoughts what you think about the doji v11 in the comment section below thanks for watching subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one Peace out.